So I have something. I was going to say that it's in the sound bag, but it didn't fit. It's kind of big. But anyway, it makes the ch, -ch sound. Okay, you ready for the clues? The clues are, it makes sounds. It makes sounds when the wind blows it. And some people hang these on their porch. It sounds like music when the wind blows. Hmm. It makes sounds. It makes sounds when the wind blows. And some people hang these on their porch outside of their house. That's where we hang ours. Ch -ch. What could it be? A ch -ch -ch. Did you say chime? Because look. A wind chime. And when the wind blows, or if you move it, it makes that beautiful sound. All right, now I'm gonna go hang this up over, hmm, maybe I'll just put it where it was. Hmm. Chime, hands up by your ears, let's clap it. Are you ready? And chime, just one clap. We didn't even have to count that with our fingers. All right, rhyme time, everybody. Chime music. No, that does not sound alike. How about, how about chime sound? Mm -mm. How about chime wind? It's a wind chime, but it doesn't rhyme. How about chime dime? Hey, that's a rhyme. Say it with me. Chime dime. How about, how about chime time. Yeah, let's say it together. Chime time. Hmm. How about chime lime? Yeah, let's say that together. Chime lime. Now, let's do it with letters. You ready to do rhyme time with letters? All right, I wrote the first one. Ch -ch chime. All of these are going to have the same ending because that's what rhymes do. They have the same ending sound. I-M-E is the I'm sound. <gasps> Wait a minute. I don't hear this E. I'm going to put an X under it because we do not, we do not even hear that thing. But that E has a special job. Some of you know this because you had the silent E on some of your keychain words. But the silent E has a special job. He tells the I. I can make two sounds, right? He tells the I always, make the sound of your name. E doesn't make any sound of his own. But he tells the I which sound to make. The sound of its name. So it's going to make the I sound, not I. Otherwise, that word would be chim. That's not even a word. Chime is the, is the word. Now, let's put a D in front of this. Do you remember how to make a D? Circle first, steady hand down the side, stop. Just so it touches that circle. Now we know that I'm, that makes the I'm sound. I'm, d, I'm, dime. Chime, dime. Yeah. Hey, let's put an L in front of it. That's an easy one to make. Big line down and stop. Lime, lime. Chime, dime, lime. How about a T? This is another easy one to make. Big line down, little line across. Let's use our sounds. T I'm, time. Chime, dime, lime, time. Hey, let's put an M in front of it. Little line down, bounce and jump, bounce and jump again. Hmm, mime, mime. You know, there are those clowns that don't talk. They just use their hands. So let's read these. Chime, dime, Lime, time, mime. I have another one. Put an R in front of it. 
Little line down, bounce and jump, but stop in the middle of the air. Rhyme, rhyme. The only problem with rhyme is, hmm, that should be the way we spell it, but it isn't. Let me show you how it really is spelled. It's an R with an H. Hey, there's that H again, but it didn't change the R sound, but the H is very quiet. And then there's Y, you know why he's a pretender and he's pretending this time that he's an i the m and the e are the same though that's how you spell rhyme the big kid way but if you spell it like that when you're writing kiss your brain because it's pretty good you used all your sounds so now let's read these words chime dime lime time mime rhyme. And those are our rhymes today.